Hello, welcome. This is an introductory video to HTML. We're going to look up what HTML is. We're going to go back in time briefly to see how it all began and how it has evolved to become what it is today. And finally, we're going to look at an example of HTML. HTML stands for Hypertext Markup Language. One thing I'd want you to note is the fact that HTML isn't a programming language, but is a markup language. HTML is the basic building block for all web pages. What this means is no website can be built without HTML. HTML defines the structure of a web page. HTML consists of a series of elements. HTML tells the browser how to display the content. HTML is the language that the browser understands. And when the browser interprets this language, it then knows how to structure and how to display content for the user as specified. Now, the history of HTML, which started in 1993. Version 1.0 was written by Tim Berners-Lee in 93. In 95, HTML2 was written. There was an improvement of version 1 and more features were added. HTML3 was written in 1997. It had powerful features, but at the time, it wasn't so efficient, so it slowed down the browsers. Version 4.0, which inherited version 3, was greatly successful because it was more efficient and was widely used throughout the 2000s. Now, the version that we're going to use in this course, which is version 5.0, was released in 2014 and is currently used worldwide. Next, we are going to look at an example of HTML. We have our HTML code on the left and our output in the browser on the right. On the left side, we basically declare the heading, place some text content within, and this text content is hello world. Now the browser interprets this text content and renders it for us. It decides that a heading should be large and have some bold styling. That's exactly what is given us with the text content that was specified. Thank you for watching this video. In the next video, we're going to discuss how to install the text editor and then we can start coding using HTML.